everybody, and this one should be a dandy this afternoon. Clear skies and just beautiful weather here for tonight's game between the Fresno State Bulldogs and the Purdue Boilermakers. And here come the Boilermakers. Brad Nestler set to bring you the play-by-play, -play, joined by the coach, Lee Corso, and the quarterback, Kirk Herbstreit. And before we get into the game, we want to wish you and yours happy holidays. The Bulldogs are going to have to play a great football game if they expect to win this one, Kirk. Well, I think you're right about that, and I'll tell you why. Purdue looks to unveil their high-powered offense, and the guy to look out for is their wideout. Lee, I'll tell you what. This defense and this young secondary is going to have their hands full because I think they're a little overmatched. I agree with you, and I'm going to tell you why. Fresno State is going to have to play a flawless game on offense if they expect to win this ball game. I don't think they got a chance. Kirk, I don't see them moving the ball much against this superior defense. Thanks, guys. Looks like we're going to have an action-packed game. So let's get down to the field where they're waiting for the coin toss. And the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick. Not a real deep kick, should be returned. Number 87 takes it from the six. Spin move. They'll take over at the 30-yard line. Fresno State lines up with three receivers. Looking. Now he's scrambling. He's looking for his man. And it's caught. Number 47 with a takedown at the 43-yard line. Oh, what a play. <laughs> you talk about robo quarterback. That last pass looked like robo quarterback type throw all the way. It's first and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. Fresno State comes to the line with three wide. He spins. He's at the 30. Inside the 20. The 10. He's going to take it to the barn. Touchdown. That run was really special. Oh, it sure was. That was a huge play by the halfback. He knows how to break the game wide open. I've got to see that one again. So with over seven minutes left here in the first quarter, our score, Fresno State, seven, Purdue, nothing. Fresno State to kick this one off. Number 25 and number six set to return. Kicks it off. Number 25 fields it in the end zone. He's hit and got away. They'll go to work at the 26. Purdue comes out in the shotgun, looks, lets it go. Incomplete pass. Incomplete pass. Number 21, the intended receiver on the play. Second and 10, ball on the 26. The Boilermakers come out in a shotgun. 
They'll run the option. Fakes it. He laterals the ball. And he's tackled at the 34-yard line. They grab eight yards there. Third and two coming up here. Ball on the 34-yard line. They line up in the jumbo set. Number 18 pitches out to the right. And they hit him in the backfield. And that brings up fourth down. Great stop by the defense. They played with tremendous character on those downs. It's fourth down and six. Ball on the 30. They line up to punt this one away. Number two, fields it at the 38. What I like about this is the guys stayed in their lanes and didn't allow the big play. They'll start this drive at the 37-yard line. Fresno State goes with the ace set here. They'll run the option. Now he pitches it. Nice spin move. Number 28 brings him down at the 45. An eight-yard gain. Second and two coming up here. Ball on their own 45. The Bulldogs set up in the gun. And he's going to lose yards on this one. And they snuffed out the quarterback draw there. And there was absolutely no place for that quarterback to run on that play. Good job by this defense. Now it's third and six coming up. Ball on the 41. Purdue brings in the nickel here. He's looking. He passes it, and he drops it. That'll bring up fourth down. Fourth down, and let me say one thing. This defense was up to the task that time in shutting down the pass play. Yeah, they shut it down, and they got the three and out they were looking for. It's fourth down and six. Ball on their own 41. They line up to punt this one away. Number 84 fields it at the 19, and he didn't get anything on that return. Well, the coverage team did an outstanding job at containing here. You always see this with this team. They're very disciplined on special teams. They'll get the ball here at the 20. Fresno State comes out in a 4-3. The handoff on the counter. There's a missed tackle. Number 18 recovers a loose ball. Looks like the offense has recovered the ball. It's always a relief when you see one of your teammates come up with a football. And that halfback has to be especially happy. He's the one who coughed it up in the first place. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 18-yard line. Four-man front by the defense. Cut. 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 They hand it off. He's out to the 30, to the 40. They'll bring him down at the 45. And that had big play written all over it. Woo, did it ever. Great-looking run by the big man. You're right, Kurt. That was a huge play. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 45. The Bulldogs put four men up front. Number three gets the call. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. And that was a big mistake on that run. Yeah, he tried to make something out of nothing. Nine out of ten times you're going to end up hurting your team by doing something stupid like that. Second and long, ball on the 39-yard line. 
They come out in a nickel. Number 18, back to throw. Looking. He goes downtown. Number five with a takedown at the 41-yard line. How about that reception, Lee? A good throw plus a nice catch and some good blocking equals to a chunk of yards. That's exactly what you practice all the time, Brad. First and ten. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Number 18 has five receivers lined up here. He drops back. Under heavy pressure. Complete. And down he goes at the 29. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense. And the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. It's first and ten. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Going with the shotgun here. Back to pass. He lets it go. It falls incomplete in the direction of his wideout. There was no way that his receiver could have gotten to that one. It's second down and 10 to go. This is the seventh play of this drive. Fresno State lines up in a dime defense here. Number 18 gives it up the middle. Number 10 brings him down at the 27. They'll get two on that one. It's third down and eight to go. This is the eighth play of this drive. The Boilermakers line up with five receivers. Number 18 drops back. He rifles it to the left, and it's caught. Brought down at the 11-yard line. And Herbie, that was a good-looking throw. Yeah, and what impresses me is the composure of this young quarterback. He made a great read, saw the open receiver, and delivered an almost perfect strike. Good-looking play. It's first and 10. Ball on the 11-yard line. Four-man front by the defense. Set. Put hard. Cut. Put hard. Put hard. It's just right. And they got him for a loss. The defensive line was just too overpowering and didn't give the running back much of a chance there. Second and long, 10th play of this drive coming up. Fresno State comes out in a 4-3. Number 18 drops to throw, fires a bullet over the middle. Incomplete. He's short that time. No question. He had him open, but just couldn't manage to get the ball up enough to allow his wide receiver to get his hands on it. Here's a third and long situation. Ball on the 17-yard line. The Bulldogs line up in a nickel back. Drop back to pass. He steps up. He unloads it. Number 84 has it. Number 55 brings him down for a loss. They lose three yards there. Fourth and a bunch coming up here. Ball on the 20-yard line. Number 18 lines up for the field goal. It's up. And it's wide left. No good. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. The defense sets up with five defensive linemen. He drops back. He fires left side. Complete. Number 28 with a takedown at the 38. And a nice catch by the wideout that time.
First and ten. Ball on their own 38. Defense lines up. Eight men in the box. Back to pass. Here comes the pressure. He pump fakes. Let's it fly. And it's caught. And he's taken down at the 36-yard line. And now he's closing in on 3,500 yards with that last pass. Wow, those are some pretty impressive season totals. And that'll be the end of the first quarter with our score. Fresno State, 7. Purdue, nothing. Now the teams have switched sides, and we're ready for the start of the second quarter. It's first and 10. Ball on the 36. Fresno State lines up in a double tight set. Number 15 drops back to pass. Complete. A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here, and the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. It's second and inches, ball on the 26-yard line. Number 15 comes to the line with three wide. Number 15 gives it up the middle. A little shake and bake move. Tackle at the 24-yard line. The running back gets the first. First and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. Defense lines up in a 3-4. He's tackled at the 21-yard line. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. Second and seven. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Purdue lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 15, back to pass. Fires across the middle, and down he goes at the 12. And a nice pickup through the air. I'll tell you what, fellas, I love this kid's throwing ability. He's got a quick release, and he's very accurate. It's first and 10. This is the seventh play of this drive. The Bulldogs line up with three wide. Number 15 gives it up the middle. They'll bring him down at the four-yard line. A nice pickup of about eight yards. The Bulldogs come to the line with their jumbo package. Here's a pitch left side. Bounces off the would-be tackler. Tackle at the four. No game. Right. It's power football time, folks. Number 15, steps back to pass. Rolls right. Touchdown, Bulldogs! Nice job by the quarterback to get into the end zone. He did what he had to do. The receivers didn't get open for him, so he tucked it down and ran. And he tacks on the extra point. Just over five minutes now remaining in the second quarter. And the score, Fresno State, 14, Purdue, nothing. Fresno State is ready to kick it away. 
Number six and number 25 back to return. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Number six fields it in the end zone. the 22. Number three lines up as a single back. Number 18 drops back. And they couldn't hook up on that one. And that was out of reach for his tight end. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 22. Number 18 lines up in the shotgun. Number 18. Options out. Laterals back. He spins around. Loses the football. And that is not what they needed. They already needed a couple of scores to get back in this. Now a turnover? What else could go wrong? First and ten, ball on the 26-yard line. They come out with four linebackers. The counter takes off a tackle. Number 40 brings him down at the 23-yard line. So the old counter gets two, maybe three yards. Second and seven, ball in the 23. Fresno State comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. He's in trouble. Throws it out there, and it's caught. Number 22 with a takedown at the 18. Five yards. Third and two, ball on the 18-yard line. The Boilermaker put four men up front. A handoff. Number 51 brings him down for a loss. Nowhere to go on that play, Coach. Boy, you're absolutely right, Brad. This is a great job by the defense in not giving him any room to create anything. It's fourth down and three yards to go. Ball on the 19-yard line. Number 32 is lined up for the kick. The kick is up. And it splits the upright. Fresno State to kick. Number 25 and number six, deep to return. We should have a return on this one. Number 25 takes it at the four, spins up field. start this drive at the 25. Fresno State lines up with five defensive back. Number 31 brings him down at the 31. About six yards on the quarterback draw. It's second down and four to go. Ball on the 31. Number three, alone in the backfield. Number 18, crosses to the left side. Instead of running around the defenders, he ran right into them. I don't think it mattered if he ran left or right or over the top. They just lost the battle up front.
Third and ten. Ball on their own 25. The defense lines up with six DBs. Number 18 drops to throw. Looks. Fires a bullet out to the right. Complete. Number 39 with a takedown at the 45. A nice pass play there. Let me tell you, the reason why this play worked was the fact that the defense didn't do a good job of knocking the wide receiver off his route. You got to jam him at the line and throw their timing off. It's first and 10, ball on their own 45. Purdue lines up in a shotgun set, and they hit him in the backfield. The Boilermakers are going to take a timeout, and they've got two remaining. Second and 13. This is the fifth play of this drive. The Boilermaker come out in a shotgun, under pressure. He throws it, batted away. Good awareness defensively that time by the linebacker. Not only that, but as you saw, he also made a very athletic move to get to the ball. Third and 13 coming up. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Purdue in a five-wide set. Number 18, back to throw. He's looking, steps up in the pocket, tipped away. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. Fourth and 13, ball on their own 42. The Boilermakers are lining up to punt it away. Number two, back deep to return. Number two signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 21-yard line. They'll get the ball here at the 21-yard line. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Back to pass. Steps up, looking. He's looking for his man, and it's knocked down. The defense needed that one. How about the move here by this cornerback? Great play that time, getting a hand on the football. So it's second and 10. Ball on their own 21. They line up with trips to the left. Number 15 drops back to pass. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. The defense calls a timeout. And they'll have one timeout left. Third and 14 coming up here. Ball on the 17. The Boilermaker bring in the nickel package. And off. Number 34 brings him down at the 17-yard line. The defense calls a timeout, and now they got no timeouts left. Fourth and 14 coming up. Ball on their own 17. They line up to punt this one away. Number 84 calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 39. Take over at the 39 yard line. Number 18 lines up with five wide out. Number 18 back to pass. Let's it go. Incomplete. And he threw that one up for grabs. This is one of the things that drives a coach crazy. 
You don't want to do anything stupid. Make mental mistakes that may cost you the ball game. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 39. Fresno State lines up in a dime defense here. Drops back to pass. He passes it, and it's caught. And down he goes at the 39. No gain. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on the 39. They come out in a nickel. Number 18 steps back to pass. Rifles it over the middle. So the defense gets him to go three and out. Good job here defensively forcing this incomplete pass. It's fourth down and 10 yards to go. Ball on the 39-yard line. It's fourth down now, and we'll see the punt team. Number two signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 22. They'll go to work at the 22. Number 15 is back in the gun. Number two hangs on to it. Number 47 with a takedown at the 26-yard line. About four yards on that play. Number 15 drops back. Incomplete pass. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads-up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. Third and six, ball on the 26-yard line. Fresno State lines up in a goal line set. Number 15 gives it up the middle. Brought down at the 30. They didn't have the ball on there. Having ball control is important in football, and three it out is what you want to avoid for sure. Now it's fourth down and two yards to go. Ball on the 30. Folks, let's pause now as we've reached the end of the first half. Our score at halftime, Fresno State, 17, Purdue, nothing. Fresno State will be kicking off to start the second half. Kicks it off. Number 25 takes it at the 8. They'll start this drive at the 21-yard line. Fresno State lines up defensively in a 4-3. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He lets it go. Number three makes a catch. A yard on the play action that time. Second and nine. Ball on their own 22. Number three, lines up as a single back. Number 18, gives up the middle. He jukes. Number 93, brings him down at the 27-yard line. Four, maybe five yards on the run. It's third down and four to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. 4-3 defense. Number 
45. Takes a handoff. Tackle at the 28-yard line. Three and out. Yeah, the defense did a great job of winning that series. It's fourth down and three yards to go. Ball on the 28. No surprise here as they prepare to punt it away. Number two calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 40. They'll get the ball here at the 40. Fresno State comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. He's under pressure. He's hit and got away. And down he goes at the 44-yard line. The quarterback trying to make a play. Well, he did a nice job of getting some yards there on the scramble, but he needs to learn to slide to avoid those big hits. It's second down and six to go. Ball on their own 44. The Boilermaker. Line up at a 3-4. it on the turf and he stopped behind the line the fullback fumbled the ball but the offense recovered it I can't imagine they'll let him get too many more touches after that I agree with you Kirk fullbacks don't get the ball very often and this guy's having problems holding on to the football yeah, I bet he sticks to lead blocking for the rest of the game it's third down and six to go ball on the 44 number 15 has four receivers lined up here number 15 drops to throw looks under heavy pressure. They'll make the sack. They put the pressure on, and it paid off. Well, his protection just simply broke down, and if that continues, this quarterback's going to have a long day. It's fourth down and 10 yards to go. Ball on the 40. It's fourth down, and the punt team lines up. Number 84 signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 25-yard line. They'll take over at the 25. The Bulldogs come out in a 34 defense. Number 18 gives it up the middle. Jukbu, and he's taken down at the 27. A two-yard run by the halfback. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 27-yard line. Purdue lines up in a shotgun set. Number 18 drops back to pass. He unloads it. Complete. Number 39 with a takedown at the 49. The wide receiver picks up good yardage that time. First and 10. Ball on their own 49. Number 18 lines up with five wide out. Back to pass. Let's it fly. Swatted away. Guys, he threw that one right into the coverage. Kirk, nothing gets a coach more fired up than to throw the ball into coverage. Oh, wait. Uh, <clears throat> you never made mistakes like that, did you? No, of course not. Second and 10. Ball on the 49-yard line. The Boilermakers line up with five receivers. Can't wrap him up. Tackle at the 47. They got four yards on that one. It's third down and six to go. This is the fifth play of this drive. Number 18 with four wide receivers. Throws it out there, and it's incomplete. And the wideout had trouble holding on there. And I'll tell you what, he was holding on for dear life there. 
I don't think he was concerned about the ball too much on that play. Nah. It's fourth down and six. Ball on the 47-yard line. The Boilermaker. Line up to punt. Number two. Number two calls for the fair catch. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They'll go to work at the 20-yard line. Four-man front by the defense. Number six brings him down for a loss. Well, that play sure didn't work. Brad, this is a sensational play by the defense. They just charged in there, and they stuffed it. Second and ten. Ball on their own 20. Purdue going with a three-man front. They hand it off. Breaks one. And he's tackled at the 26-yard line. A good six yards there by the fullback. It's third down and four to go. Ball on the 26-yard line. Number 15 with three wide receivers. Drops back to pass. He throws it. And he dropped it. Well, the defense stood tall there. Well, the defense did what they had to do to get three and out and now get the offense back on the field. Fourth and four coming up on this play. Ball on the 26. They line up to punt this one away. Number 84 signals for a fair catch. They'll start this drive at the 30-yard line. The Boilermakers line up with five receivers. Sheds a tackler. Brought down at the 38. A nice pickup of about eight yards. Second and two. Ball on the 38. Four three defense. Foot hot. Foot hot. Number 18, back to pass. He's looking. Deep pass down the left side. Number 82 with a catch. Touchdown, Boilermakers. Kirk, what do you have for him? That catch put the receiver over 100 yards. He's been one of the quarterback's favorite targets all game long. Coach, tell me about this one. The quarterback does a nice job of getting the ball to the open guy. Then that kid shows you right there what he can do after he has the football. And he tacks on the extra point. Just over a minute to go here in the third quarter. And the score, Purdue, 7, Fresno State, 17. Purdue to kick this one off. Number 87 and number 2 back ready to return. Kicks it off. Number two takes from the 10. Number two on the return. return. 
First and ten. Ball on their own 21. Four-man front by the defense. First down and 15 to go. Ball on the 16. He drops back. He's looking for his man. The wideout catches it out of bounds. Yeah, the ruling here is that you got to have possession of the football and at least one foot in bounds. You can see that he didn't get a foot in, and that's a good call. Second and 15. Ball on their own 16. Number 15 is back in the gun. Number 15 steps back to pass. He lobs it left. Incomplete. Third and 15 coming up. Ball on their own 16. They come out in a nickel. Number 15 back to throw. Let's it go. And it falls incomplete. Looks like they had a guy wide open there, fellas. Yo, how'd they get that guy so wide open? Boy, they were lucky he didn't get it to him. Fourth down at 15. Ball on their own 16. Fresno State lining up the punt. Number 84 calls for the fair catch. They'll get the ball here at the 49-yard line. Fresno State comes out in a 4-3. This tackle. Number 88 brings him down at the 47. Four yards gained on that quarterback draw. Second and six. Ball right around midfield. Number 18 comes to the line. Three wide. Nothing doing. Tackled for a loss on the play. And the defense was ready for that play. Boy, you better believe it. That play didn't have a chance. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on the 49. Number 18 lines up in the shotgun. Number 18 drops to throw. Looking. He passes it. And that one's fallen incomplete. He just let his wide out a little too much that time. It's fourth and eight. Ball on the 49-yard line. The Boilermakers are lining up to punt it away. Number two signals for a fair catch. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So that brings us to the end of the quarter. And at the end of three, our score, Fresno State, 17, Purdue, 7. And we're ready for the start of the fourth quarter. It's first and 10, ball on the 20. Purdue lines up defensively in a 4-3. They hand it off. Sheds that one. He tries to spin. 
Number 28 with a takedown at the 23. The back gets three on the carry. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on their own 23. The Bulldogs come out in the ace formation. Number 15 gives it up the middle. Number 34 brings him down at the 23-yard line. Nothing going on that one. It's third down and seven to go. Ball on the 23. Number 15 with three wide receivers. Number 15 on play action. And it's caught. Number nine with a takedown at the 39. A good pickup on the play action pass. First and 10. Ball on the 39. Four man front by the defense. Number 15 drops back to pass. Looks, he fires right, and they couldn't hook up on that one. And that will stop the clock. Yeah, Brad, that doesn't make too much sense to me. You got the lead. Just run the football. Keep the clock running. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 39. Number 15 comes to the line with three wide. He's looking. He's going to try and scramble. He lets it go. Incomplete pass. The clock will stop with that incompletion. Boy, I don't understand that strategy at all. With the lead late in the game, you just need to run the football. That's not a smart decision. Third and 10. Ball on the 39-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. Back to pass. He unloads it. Number 28 brings him down at the 39-yard line. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. First and 10. This is the seventh play of this drive. Fresno State comes to the line with three wide. Drops back to pass. He steps up, lets it fly, and it's incomplete. That one way too far out in front. You know what, guys? That's what I refer to as a radio ball. You can hear it, you just can't see it. And if the receiver can't see it, then he's not going to catch it. Second and ten. Eighth play of this drive coming up. Purdue comes out at a 4-3. Here's a counter play. Number 51 with a takedown at the 36-yard line. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. It's third down and seven to go. This is the ninth play of this drive. The Boilermakers line up with six defensive backs. Number 15, back to pass. Rifles it right side. Number two, has it. Number 12, brings him down at the 19. Oh, my, that long game gives him a first down, Coach. A first down and a nice pass play. Knowing you can convert on third and long will open up your offense a little bit more on first and second. Let's see what they do from here. First and 10. Tenth play of this drive coming up. The Boilermaker. Line up in a 4-3. Off, get past the tackler. They'll bring him down at the 13. They pick up a good six yards there. Second and four coming up here. This is the 11th play of this drive. Purdue lines up defensively in a 4 3. Number 
15. Gives it up the middle. And he's taken down at the 12. A one-yard gain by the halfback. Third down and three coming up. Twelfth play of this drive coming up. The Bulldogs go with the I formation. They hand it off. Number 61 with a takedown at the 11. They try to play a little power football there. Yeah, but they got outpowered. Now it's fourth down and two yards to go. Ball on the 11-yard line. Number 32 in to attempt the short field goal. It's up. And it's through the upright. Fresno State lines up for the kickoff. Not a real deep kick, should be returned. Number six takes it at the four. There's a flag on the play. He's hit and got away. Holding, Holding on the receiving, on the receiving team. team. Ten yard penalty, first down. First down. They'll take over at the 15. Number three, alone in the backfield. He drops back. Looking, throws it out there. Number 84, hangs on to it. And they make the stop at the 27-yard line. That one was nearly overthrown. Boy, the receiver makes a great play by putting his hands up. He had enough vertical leap to get his hands on it. Drops back a pass. Here comes the pressure. He throws it. Complete. And a nice catch by the wideout that time. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. Number 18 has five receivers lined up here. Number 18 steps back to pass. He's looking for his man. And it's caught. Brought down at the 35. <laughs> Number 18 drops to throw. Number 82 makes a catch. And that catch right there just pushed him over 1,000 yards, fellas. Well, this is a great accomplishment for anyone. 1,000 yards receiving is pretty special. <laughs> Number 18 drops back. Let's it go. Complete. And down he goes at the three. Not a bad play there. Not at all. And if this wideout can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around, this offense is going to be tough to stop. Back to pass. He passes it, and it's complete for the touchdown. Nice touchdown combination on that one. Oh, yeah, this receiver and quarterback are on the same wavelength at all times during this football game. And he tacks on the extra point. So under three minutes to go in the fourth quarter. And the score is Purdue 14, Fresno State 20.
Purdue to kick. Number two and number 87 back deep to return. And it's a short kickoff. Number two fields it at the 11. A little juke. Spin move. Holding, Holding on the receiving, on the receiving team. team. Ten yard penalty. penalty. First down. First down. They'll go to work at the 17. Fresno State will line up in a jumbo set here. Number 34 gets a carry left side. Number 12 brings him down at the 26. That's a good nine-yard gain. It's second down and one to go. Ball on the 26-yard line. The Bulldogs come to the line with their jumbo packet. Number 15 gives it up the middle. There's a missed tackle. He spins. Number 28 with a takedown at the 35-yard line. The Boilermakers call for a timeout, and they've got two remaining. First and ten. Ball on the 35-yard line. Purdue comes out in a 4-3. Number 81 gets it on the inside. And he's taken down at the 40. The Boilermakers are going to take a timeout. And now they've only got one remaining. Second down and five. Ball on the 40. Fresno State lines up in a goal line set. Number 47 brings him down at the 42. He plows ahead for a two-yard gain. We get third and three here. Ball on their own 42. The Bulldogs line up in a goal line formation. Play action. He lets it go. And it falls incomplete. Not a good decision here by the quarterback throwing into coverage. Fourth and three coming up. Ball on the 42. Number 84, the return man. Number 84 calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 22-yard line. Ball on the 22. Purdue sets up with four receivers. Number 18, back to throw. Looks. He unloads it. Number five, knocks it away. And they do a good job at swatting that one away. You're right, Brad. Excellent awareness by the defender to know where the football is and his get his hand on it. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 22. They come out in a nickel. Number 18 drops back to pass. Guns it across the middle. Number 29 tips it away. The safety comes up with a nice play. Nice job of the safety here, sitting back and playing center field, and then seeing the ball and coming up and simply batting the ball away. Third and ten. Ball on their own 22. They come out in a nickel. 
Number 18 steps back to pass. He's looking. He lets it go deep down the middle. And he dropped it. Fourth and ten coming up. Ball on the 22-yard line. Obvious passing situation here. Hut, 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 hut. Number 18 drops to throw. He guns it to the right. Picks it off. Bounces off the would-be tackler. That turnover will probably do it for this team. Boy, when it comes to last-minute drives, it seems like we see more and more turnovers because you're trying to hurry up, and some players just aren't on the same page with everybody else. It's first and ten. Ball on the 26. The Boilermaker come out in a 4-3. The Boilermaker call for a timeout, and that was their last timeout. Second down and 12. Ball on the 28. Defense lines up in a 4-3. It's third down and 14 to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Purdue lines up in a dime defense here. Number 15 gives up the middle. Number 33 with a takedown at the 28-yard line. So they come up well short on that run. Well, here it's third and long. I'm assuming they just wanted to protect the football and keep the clock running. And that's the end of the game. Coach, what's your final thought on the game? Yo, this was a spectacular football game. Fresno State played one of the best games out there. They made some big plays on defense and capitalized on some key opportunities. And they ended up stealing this victory. What a nail biter. Folks, thanks for tuning into this game. Our final score, Fresno State 20, Purdue 14. We hope you enjoyed this game as much as we enjoyed bringing it to you. So long, everyone.